The Playoff Central Live presented by AT&T 5G. I'm Chris Miles and that's 3D. He's back in studio, so you know what we say. We're doing it like we're doing it to do it for TV. Let's do it. Round two, game three is coming up. But before we get you ready for Friday's action, let's go over some updates from around the league because a lot of things happening affecting the games. And we start with Gary Payton II will miss a month that fractured elbow. Only way he returns is if the Warriors make it to the finals. Dylan Brooks was ejected for that flagrant two in game two. He's now been suspended for game three. So 3D, does that punishment fit the crime? Because essentially he's missing two games for that foul. Yeah, uh, I think most people understand after watching that, you know, it's the wind up I think catches the casual fan by guard because when you're going to block a shot, it's your natural movement to try to wind your arm up to block it. But we all understand you have to understand that Gary Payton Jr. is leaving the ground, the way he's falling. So I, I'm not mad. Some people wanted two games. I'll take the one game. But big picture for the Warriors, he was the best fit. I know Jai had the 47. Jai you know, averaged, what, 41 and some change in the two games. But the way we know Gary Payton II could put pressure on him all game long, and that's his specialty. And he was knocking down enough threes to kind of make himself favorable on the other side of the floor as well. So he's going to be sorely missed if the Warriors make it to the play, uh, yeah, finals. Absolutely. He was in the starting lineup because of his ability to defend. Also had 10 points in yeah. the fourth quarter in that game he was one solid. win. He was solid. Very valuable piece. Sad to see him go down. Uh, ben Simmons had back surgery. The Nets announced micro dissectomy procedure to alleviate pain caused by a herniated disc. Recovery time is three to four months. Thought is he'll be ready for training camp next year. So best wishes to 